Mode set. Executing. What's up, gamers? It's your boy, CDROM 1019. Welcome back to the Secret of Monkey Island Special Edition. Alright, so a couple of quick things. I didn't notice on the first two episodes of recording, because I kind of recorded them back to back. Um, I didn't notice that the sound was a little weird. Um, so I've made a few adjustments, turned the game audio up a little bit, and I turned down my TV a little, so there we should get less echo this time. So, uh, hopefully that's better. Apologies for that, and let's uh, continue the adventure. When last we left off, uh, there appears to have, uh, like, well, uh, the ghost pirate where Chuck came and took a lane, uh, but everyone's out of the scum bar, uh, there seems to be a bunch of stuff going wrong here. So, uh, we need to acquire a ship, put a crew together, and go after him to save Elaine Marley. So, let's go, uh, previously we visited, um, Stan's, uh, used boats, so let's go see if he's at his post there and have a word with him about acquiring a boat. Uh, let's see, Stan's is over this way, the used ship emporium. Oh, it's Stan. I'm Stan of Stan's previously owned vessels, and I'd stand on my head to make you a deal. What sort of craft are you looking for? Big, fast, slow. You want it? I got it. And if I don't got it, I'll get it. I want to make you a deal that you're happy with. Because if you're not happy, I'm not happy. But I know you're going to leave here happy today. How do I know? Just look at all these ships. I've got something for everyone. Oh, Come, Stan, he's a such around. a character. Can you tell that he's an excellent salesman? So tell me, what are you interested in looking at today? <clears throat> okay, by the way, no, your eyes aren't fooling you. His coat is a Photoshop gradient. So... <laughs> His coat does not move with him. And yes, everyone's noticed. And it hurts everybody's eyes. So you are not alone in this. <laughs> so, let's see. Um, we need to get a ship. Um, I need to talk to... St we're talking to Stan. Uh, let's see. I'll, tell him, I'll be up front with him tell him I don't have a lot of money. Have, much to spend. have no fear. Every ship I sell is a bargain, but if you're looking for a real steal, I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. This here is the famous Sea Monkey, the only ship ever to make it to Monkey Island Ooh. and come back with anyone aboard left alive. Or should I say, anything. You see, the previous owners of this ship were two adventurous pirates. They set off, like many before, to find the legendary Secret of Monkey Island. And like many before, they disappeared forever. Their fate? A mystery. Almost as mysterious as how this ship returned to Melee Island without a single human aboard. <laughs> Some claim it was sailed back by a crew of chimps. Chimps? There aren't any chimps in the Caribbean. Oh, shut up. It makes a good story. <laughs> anyway, this baby's mine now. That is, until someone makes me an offer. Let's talk about money. Your money. Uh, okay. Well, I've got 174 pieces of eight. Maybe I can get it on credit. Actually, I was hoping to get one on credit. Sorry, kid. Neither a borrower nor a lender be. That's just old Stan's philosophy. If you've got a job, the storekeeper in town might extend you some credit. Then we'd have something to talk about. Unless, of course, you've already got some other means of financing. Okay, well, that's a hint. Second Let's go talk to... Uh... The ship for me. Of course it isn't. You're looking for a much bigger boat. 
I can tell. So, what else can I show you? No, Stan, that that's fine, thank you. Actually, I'd like to go think about it some more. Sure, sure, think it over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. Bye now. All right, so that's a hint he left us with. Let's go talk to the shopkeeper and maybe we can get uh, we can get this uh, ship on credit. I forgot to give what? you my card. How? Wait, and I just something else to remember. How did you do that? A compass? An extra strong magnetic compass with your picture on it. That's right. It always points directly back here, so if you're looking for a good deal, you know where to go. I'll be right here when you come back. But I can't guarantee that any of these ships will. Right. They're moving fast today. Yes, sirree. Can't hardly keep anything in stock. He'll be back. <laughs> Thanks, Stan. Okay, so, uh, let's head back to the village and talk to the shopkeeper. <clears throat> Boy, I wish there was a quicker way into town than coming through here all the time. Thankfully, system the systems for these games got better over time. You'll see what I mean. Okay, go to the archway to get to the shop. Hello, sir. Had my eye on you, boy. Steal anything, and I break your legs. I'm not stealing nothing. Want? So, uh, I need I need a note of credit. In procuring a note of credit. You are. I. Uh, you got a job. Hmm. Let's lie to him and tell him we yes, do. Of course I do. All right. I'll get one of my notes and we'll fill it out. I was Let's not paying attention here. to that. What did you say your occupation was? Uh, okay. Well, I didn't memorize the combination. That's a problem. Um, I clean ships. I clean ships over at Stan's used shipyard. I haven't seen a clean ship over there in years. You're either lying or you're just a crummy worker. Either way, I don't trust you. Oh, okay, he's going to open it again. So. Full rotation left, full rotation right, full rotation left down. Okay. So one circle left, one circle right, one circle left, and then right one notch. Uh, okay, um, so he's not going to give me a note of credit because he doesn't believe me no matter what I tell him. So, why don't we just take one instead? I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. But I need him to get out of here first. Look, I told you she doesn't want to see you. Maybe if you asked her again? Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there again. Be right back. And don't touch anything! Oh, I'm totally touching all the stuff. All right, so... Let's walk to the handle. <clears throat> uh, pull. Okay. Wait, what? How does this thing work? I can only pull it or I can walk to it. What? 
So one circle this way. And then... Oh! Push. Okay. Duh. Oh, come on. Alright. And then... Pull. Where's my pull command? Two, three, four, and then push once. Hmm. There we go. There's nothing in here but this note. Okay. I've got a note of credit. Uh okay. Let's head back to uh Stan and give him this note of credit. Close the door. Get back to stands. Okay. Back to stands you ship emporium. Howdy. Great to see you again. I knew <coughs> you'd come back. Excuse me. Everybody does. You know why they come back? Just look at all these ships. I've got something for everyone. Come, take a look around. Yeah, thank you, Stan. I get it. So, what else can I show you? All right, so, uh... Uh, I definitely don't want to see the best ship. Um, I can only buy the cheap ship. See, I, so I can only really buy the ship in the back there. Um. Uh, could I see the cheap one again? I knew it. I knew it. Just can't get her out of your mind, can you? Walk this way. It's funny to think that the only ship that ever made it from Monkey Island and back is considered the cheap ship. But Hard okay. To away from a good mystery, isn't it? Hmm? What kind of price range were you thinking of? Uh, let's see. I got credit, I got from, credit the from the storekeeper. Will you take it? Hey, of course. Your credit's always good at stands. It doesn't matter if you've had credit problems in the past. Divorce, chronic gambling mishaps. <laughs> I mean, who am <coughs> I to judge, right? If the storekeeper trusts you enough to give you a letter of credit, then you must be an honest man with a steady income, right? Sure, let's uh, go with that. Right. Let's get down to brass tack, shall we? I know you want it. You know you want it. And I know that you know that I want to sell it, so... Uh, okay. What do you no, think it's worth? Think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away today for just 10,000 pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? Uh, okay. I don't think this line of credit is good for 10,000. So let's haggle with them. Let's em. talk extras. Extras? You want to talk extras? Great! This baby's loaded with extras. Awesome. For I don't want any of them. Did I tell you about the porthole defoggers? Definitely don't need that. I think we can. I think I can I live think without I that. I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but don't <coughs> blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the anti-lock anchor? Anti-lock anchor. Don't need that I think either, I can Stan. Live without that particular piece of junk. Sure, throw safety to the wind. 
But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? Also don't want. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Well, I guess it'll float without it. Barely. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the velour sail covers? Don't need those either, Stan. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Hey, travel light. I can understand that, sure. Of course, mutiny is an ugly word. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the tachometer? Don't need a tachometer. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Wow, does your wife know you're such a cheapskate? Don't have one, Stan. There's more. Did I tell you about the elevator made with wood from burgundy wine casks? Certainly don't need that, Stan. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Yeah, I guess that is kind of decadent, isn't it? But wait, there's more. Oh, for crying out loud, Stan, I don't want it. Wood siding. Don't need simulated wood siding. It's already wood. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but I'm telling you, barnacles hate simulated wood. That's but nice. Wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the porthole defoggers? Okay, we're we're just enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? Uh, I'll make, make you an make offer. An offer. <clears throat> Great. How much? Uh. Oh yikes. Uh, can I can I talk him down that low? I'd like to pay two thousand pieces of eight. Sure. I guess we can start <laughs> out at the bottom. I got all day. I'm going to be getting a whole new shipment next week, so you got me over a barrel. I've got to sell this baby, even if it means losing my shirt. All right, wait well, a minute. What do you think it's worth? You could sell this puppy away today for just 7,300 pieces of eight. How does okay, that sound no, you? not interested. Um... I'd like Can to make I'm you an offer. Great. I f do How I have to much? keep making offers? I I gotta see here. Well, how does three thousand pieces of eight sound? That's a little bit more like it, but not much. I know you can try harder than that. Just tell me, what would it take to get you to sail this ship away today? Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sell this okay, yep, so we're going in the right direction. So I just I just gotta bargain with him until I can get below 5,000. Because that's how much the, the line of credit's worth, so. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Uh, actually, okay. Actually, I'd like you to squirm a little more. Sure. Hey, that's my job, isn't it? You I think I need to threaten you? to... They just don't make them like this I anymore. think I need to threaten to walk out before I make another low offer, so... I don't need this boat anyway. Now, wait a second. Don't go away mad. I'm sure we can work something out. Well, maybe you're right. Okay. Of course I am. Now, where were we? Oh, yeah, buddy, you can tell me the truth. It's the little woman, isn't it? You're afraid of what she'll say when you come home with a new ship. <laughs> Don't be such a wimp. Stand up to her. She'll respect you for it. And when she sees this ship, she'll love you for it. Trust me. All right, so um, I already turned on all the extras. I threatened to walk out. I'd like to I need to make another low offer. Great. How much? I'll tell him low offer. I'd like to pay two thousand pieces of eight. I think we're working in the wrong direction here. You know we are. I know you can try harder than that. I don't okay. understand. I thought you were interested in this ship. What well, is it? What is it worth? 
You could sell this puppy away today. All right, so I guess I got to keep just making low offers. How does that sound to you? <clears throat> to make you an offer. Great. How much? Uh, all right. Okay, okay. Four. Four thousand pieces of eight. That's a little bit more like it, but not much. I know you can try harder than that. I'd let you take it out for a little spin around the harbor, but our insurance company won't. Let us. <laughs> well, what do you think it's worth? You could sell this All right, almost there. I just got to tell them 5,000 now. pieces of eight. How does that sound to you? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? 5,000 final right. offer. 5,000, but that's my final offer. 5,000 pieces of eight. Okay, okay. It's killing me, but okay. And I thought I was going to give my children Christmas presents this year. Oh, I'm so sad for you, Stan. Just take it out of here. I'm glad to get rid of it. Oh, yeah. Do you have that note from the storekeeper on you? Thanks. I've got to run these numbers by my boss. He'll think I'm nuts, but I'll talk him into it. You meet me at the dock with your crew. All right. I'll bring we got a boat. And the papers. I just want to say that I really feel like we got to know each other today. I mean, I really felt some bonding here. And I don't just say that to everybody. Yeah, okay, it's Stan. It's been great doing business with you. Really? Sucker. See you at the dock and don't forget your crew. All three of them. Okay, well, we've got a ship. Now we need to assemble a three-person crew. I have an idea of who we should ask first. <clears throat> Let's go talk to the Swordmaster again. Maybe she'd be interested in a little bit of adventure. Hey, Carla. You've already got the t-shirt. What do you want now? Uh, let's see. The governor's been kidnapped. been kidnapped. What? That's ridiculous. Oh, no. This looks bad. Very bad. I'm getting a ship and a crew together to go rescue her. Hmm. I have a feeling I'm going to regret this, but count me in. I'll meet you at the dock. All right, that's one. Okay, two more. So, let's get out of here. Okay, so, oh. Meanwhile, having just returned from Melee, LeChuck and his crew find their old hiding place in the underground rivers of Monkey Island and drop anchor. Captain, sir. I knew it. I just stopped by to congratulate you on your kidnapping mission. Captain? Captain, are you all right? Never felt better. And how fares our prisoner? Ah, yes, the uh, prisoner. <laughs> we had a little trouble. Trouble! No, 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 nothing to worry about, sir. Everything's under control. She escaped a few times, but we've got her locked up in the brig. No 
no one's getting in or out of there. For your sake, I hope not. With years of planning almost destroyed by my death, I'm not taking any chances now. You took care of Mr. Threepwood then? Guybrush Threepwood will not be a problem. At this very moment, he's 20 feet underwater. Yeah, that's what you think. Up like a fattened pig. His eyes being eaten out by crabs. Fish pecking at his fingers. Kind of makes you wish you were there to watch. Ah, yes, sir. Ugh. Sure <laughs> does it that. Now, go check on the route. Make sure it's locked up tight. <clears throat> Aye, Captain. I think that's Rob Paulson. That's interesting. Okay, so we haven't checked what's up here. Oh, actually, before I do that, let's go back to the village. Uh, so we need to visit uh, another character who is a staple of this series. And her house is in... Uh, you know what? Here, let me... Uh... Yeah, alright. Well, let me go back here, too. Because I can... Because we can, um... There's a good... We can get Otis, too. Um... So, Otis is stuck in the jail. And... We can't get him out by lock. But... We can take these mugs. Uh, can I pick up the mug? Okay. <clears throat> so, if you remember at the beginning when we were talking to the uh, three gentlemen here, they said that Grog is really acidic. It's very caustic. So, what if we pick up some mugs and then fill one up with grog and then transfer them from mug to mug until we got to the jail and we use that to like find pewter tankard uh use that's give where's use use with barrel this stuff is eating right through the mug all right gotta move quickly Oop. wait why is this here is that a glitch? Oh, it is a okay. Oh, oh, all right. That's a that's an indicator. Go, go, go. <laughs> all right. To get to the, now to get to the jail. Okay. So use I don't see anything special about it. Oh, yikes. Stop. You damn. Nope, I lost it. Rats. All right. Nope, now I got to go back. Cuz I was trying to All right. Hang on, almost had it. Got to go back to the scum bar, get another mug. All right, let's pick this up. Okay. Why can't... Oh, that's look. Oh, all right, use... All right, here we go. Run. Man, that... <laughs> That happens quick. Alright, so the second that that... Well, when I get into the town, I should probably switch it. I've got five mugs to use. Okay, so... Uh, use... Melting, melting mug with Looks like a another mug. Tankard. Did it work? Ah, darn. No, that's... 
All right, I need to figure out how this works. <laughs> so I, what I have to be, what I have to do, I, I don't know what I'm doing wrong here particularly, but I have to transfer, I have to transfer the grog, the grog from mug to mug until I can get to the jail. Let me look at my commands, make sure I'm not doing this wrong. Push, pull, use, pick up, give. Alright, let's try this again. Maybe I'll try give next time. So, whoop. use mug with barrel. Alright, let's go. Go. Come on, Guybrush. Alright, I might burn a mug just to test this. All right, let's try this again. Use mug with, nope, wait, nope. Use mug with I can't other mug. Oh, see, okay. You know what my mistake is? All right. I keep I keep trying to use the D-pad to, to, to move from place to place, and the D-pad is supposed to be um, key shortcuts, so that's why I keep getting this wrong. Pick up this mug. All right, I'll try. I'll try this next attempt once I get outside the the scum bar. All right, use mug with barrel. Okay, leave. <laughs> Okay, so use melting mug with mug. Yep, that transferred. Okay, so that's what I got to do. Get through the archway. Okay, let's transfer again. Use melting mug with mug okay into the prison a little faster there guy brush okay use melting mug with mug okay and now use mug of grog with the lock hey great a drink i'm real thirsty Yikes! Wow! And to think I used to drink that stuff. <laughs> I'm free! Oh yeah, thanks. If there's anything I can ever do for you. Well, actually, there is something. I'm looking for brave people to join my crew and sail off to Monkey Island with me to rescue the governor. She's been abducted by the fearsome pirate LeChuck and is being held against her will somewhere in his secret hideout. I see. Well, Jess, hmm. LeChuck, you say. Well, Jess, Jess, of course. We must sail to Monkey Island and... <gasps> hey, look behind you! I three had a monkey! <laughs> yeah, that's Otis, all right. I can't believe I fell for that. Pretty good trick, though. All right. Uh, so Otis. All right. Well, we'll probably come back to Otis. Uh, what's going on with this dude? May I help you? I was just on my way to the governor's mansion. Are you here for the looting? Uh, no. Absolutely not. That's good. Because we are booked up solid for the next five hours. Okay, well, I don't think I'm getting over that way. Um, okay, so we need to get one more thing. Well, we need to uh, get one more crewmate, but it's not going to happen until we have a certain item. Let's go into this odd house over here.
Ooh, fuzu. Oh, hey, look! A chicken with a pulley. That looks useful. Mm. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. What possible use could that have? Doesn't matter, you're taking Maybe it. Maybe no one will miss just this one thing. Okay. Um... Do, 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 do. Yeah, 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 okay. We could probably end up talking to the voodoo lady, but... I don't think whatever she has to tell me is that important. Um... In certain games it will be, but... I think I can do without it this game. Okay. So. I've got a rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle, and you're probably wondering... Why would you ever need that? Well, you see, <laughs> the answer will become clear to you once we try to cross the ravine. Oh, wait a minute. Can I just... Can I... Cliffside... Walk to cliffside, walk to... Alright, no, guess I have to go to the cliffside to get out of the town. Okay. To the island. <clears throat> Hook Island. Well, there's a cable here. Okay, let's use this pulley hmm. to get across. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. Oh, that was the look. What possible use could that have? You'd be surprised. Use with cable. <laughs> there we go. And let's go to the house. Uh... Oh, okay. Hey, it's Meat Hook. Hey, I don't like visitors. Who are you? Uh, the governor's been kidnapped. been kidnapped. What? That's preposterous. Oh, really? Take a look at this note they left. Oh, no. This is horrible. What are we going to do? Oh, let's see. We could get a crew together and sail we off after them. Get a crew together and sail off after them. What an idea! Now, if we only had a captain. Well, what about me? Ha! You? Ha! <laughs> <coughs> well, thanks for the vote of confidence, guy. <laughs> That's a good one. Hey, I'm serious. Really? Really? Okay, let's see you prove it. Walk this way. There's something in here that I want to show you. Something horrible. Something so horrible that I stay awake at night just thinking about it. But I don't mean to scare you. I'm sure a big, brave guy like yourself will have no problem facing this monster. After all, it's much smaller than the beast that bit off my hands so many years ago. Arr, 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 arr. Let's just hope you're quicker than I was. Uh, okay. Oh, I just remembered something. I never did get around to feeding him this week. Ha 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 ha! Silly me! I'll let you open this last door yourself. Just uh, let me get out of your way. Okay. Ha ha ha! Getting cold feet? No, I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. You're supposed to open that little door. And if you're brave enough, touch the beast inside. Oh, is that all? Okay. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> if you've got the guts. Alright, well, here we go. <laughs> A 
parrot? Really? You were afraid of a parrot? I don't believe it. You are a brave man after all. <laughs> okay. I feared all these years. You had the guts to do what I never could. I feel like such a coward. I'm not good enough to be on your crew. I'm not even good enough to swab your de 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 eggs. Oh, come on, Mr. Uh, Meat Hook. Mr. Meat Hook? You're a big, strong, good looking guy with a great tattoo. I can make a talk. Wanna see? Ha! Uh, maybe later. Anyway, you can swab my decks anytime. <laughs> really? Sure. I can still be on your crew. Just pack your stuff and meet me at the dock. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I won't let you down. That's great. <clears throat> okay. That should be all three. Um... Hey, maybe I'll get a chance to show you my whole tattoo routine when we're at sea. Wow, this is sounding better and better all the time. All right, with the alleged crew assembled, we need to head to the dock. So let's use the pulley on the cable. Whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. Get back up there, you. Use chicken cable. It works both ways. That's some chicken. <laughs> All right. Oh, come on. Walk the path. All right. Back to the village and the dock by the scum bar. <coughs> It's a good thing you showed up. Ten people have offered to buy this baby off me while I've been standing here waiting for you. But I said, no way. I know a guy who's in love with this ship, and it would break his heart to lose it. Am I right? Of course I am. I mean, just look at her. Sleek, aerodynamic, a buoyant barnacle-covered beauty. I think we're having a real moment here. Get your hand off me, Stan. <laughs> I've changed my mind. I can't give her up. Excuse you? you? have your money back. How could I sell something so dear? <laughs> then again, a deal's a deal, right? Right. <laughs> Good luck, yeah. I'm out of here. Whoops, I almost forgot to give you this free seafaring literature. My gift to you. Just remember where you got it. Stans! Thanks, Stan. Maybe I should have gotten that extended warranty after all. Hey, long time no see. Otis, I thought I'd never see you again. Hey, I could never pass up a chance to make some easy money. Uh, money? Yeah, we are getting paid for this, right? Uh, well... Glad you could make it, Carla. Look, don't start with me, okay? So what's that waterlogged wreck doing out there? How are we going to get our ship in here with that pile of scrap in the way? Well, about that... Where's the cabin boy? I need him to go back to my place and pick up <laughs> my bags. What's going on here? Where's our ship? Where's our crew? This isn't going to be as easy as I thought. Alright, that's uh, part one. Part two, the journey. Through the courageous leadership
ship of Captain Freep, uh, Threepwood, the Sea Monkey is finally underway. Undaunted by their lack of navigational equipment or expertise, the crew begins to plan their voyage. First of all, I'd like to say it's great to be working with such a fine crew. The voyage ahead is not going to be easy. It's going to take skill, endurance, and most of all, teamwork. First, I thought we'd assign some duties. What is it we were suckered into doing again? I made a list. Suckered is right. I don't see what the big deal is with rescuing the governor. She can clearly take care of herself. The way I look at it, we got this great ship. Well, we got a ship. Why don't we kick back, tie a rope to the wheel, and cruise for a while? I could use a little work on my tan. Come to think of it, I have been a little stressed out lately. I could use a rest. Then it's decided. We cruise the Caribbean. Uh, okay. Assumed. So here's my crew quarters. Let's uh, take a look around, I guess. Well, that's open. I don't know if that did anything. <laughs> okay. It's made. Must be dealer prep. It seems to be locked up tight. Okay, so this cabinet's locked up tight. I think I need to get in there. <coughs> so let's go looking around. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> uh, think. Hey guys, what's happening? Beat it, guy brush. All right. What? Walk to mutinous crew. I hear the weather's pretty nice over by Monkey Island. Nice try, guy brush, but no banana. All right. Well, uh, rope ladder. Okay, so I'm up here now, but I don't think anything's gonna. Fine looking flag. All right, Sugar get back down to the deck. Just looking at it. All right, so this is the only way inside, right? So covered in the kitchen. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Hang on. Yeah, I should explore the ship. All right, let's go up here. Uh, hatch behind the mast on the main deck. Oh, there it is. I didn't even see that. Okay. Uh, do -do 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 -do. Let's go down here. All right, this must be the kitchen. What's in here? Cereal? Okay. Loved this stuff when I was a kid. All right, well, I let's like take one. Chewed up the roof of your mouth. Okay. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Can I? Oh. That doesn't seem to work. Right. Can I use? Oops. Cereal. Wait, what? Oh, d I keep forgetting that we have an open command. Open cereal. Great. A toy prize inside. Oh, okay. Let's open this toy prize. This is no prize. It's a small key with a finely engraved monkey on it. A key, you say? <clears throat> All right. Well, let's go back into the cab into uh, the corridors here. See if I can use this key with this cabinet. Yep. It looks like a very heavy metal chest. Okay, well, open it. Oh, right. Open chest. Man, 
that's heavy. Filled, no doubt, with golden jewels. Well, is it? What did it give me? Is it open or not? Open chest. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Duh. Where's a uh, look at chest? Hey, look, a piece of paper. Okay, here we go. And some cinnamon sticks. Okay. Look at this piece of paper. Directions to Monkey Island. Uh -huh. Preheat pot to 450 degrees. Add the following ingredients. One cinnamon stick. Four leaves of mint. What? One human skull, pressed. One squirt squid ink. Two pints monkey blood. Mm. One live chicken. Three ounces brimstone. One or more of the following. Pyridoxine hydrochloride. Zinc oxide. Yellow 8, mine mononitrate, and BHA. Let bubble over a low flame until thickened. Serves crew of four. Uh-huh. Well. So... I need to think about this for a second. So, I guess I'm going to need to make this... Um, to just to get to Runt Monkey Island. I have to make this and serve it to the crew, I guess? So, um, I've got... I'm going to have to get these ingredients. I've got the cinnamon stick. Um, so, we need some mint. Uh, don't I have... Okay. Actually, let's go back down into the kitchen. <clears throat> See if there's a... Oh, there is a pot here. Okay, beautiful. So, I will use... I don't see anything special about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use the cinnamon with the I pot. I love cinnamon. I don't have mint, but I have breath mints that I picked up. Good thing I've got a million of these. Okay. Uh, I think I got a bunch of them, though, that I'm going to have to... Oh, yeah, I need four of these, so I'm going to have to use this. Good thing I've got Two. a million of these. Breathmaster for the pirate who cares about first impressions. Three. Good thing I've got a million of these. And four. Good thing I've got a million of these. Okay. So one human pressed skull. Hmm. Well, I can't get a real skull, but I could get the skull that's on our flag. Because that's pressed. Okay. Yada, 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 yada. Right, right, right. Oop. Didn't mean to do that. Get down there. Okay. Use the Jolly Roger with our mix. Squid ink. I don't really... Any kind of ink would probably work. Hmm. Map. A staple remover. A business card. The possibility that I need to use these notes. Uh... Oh! No, even better. There was a quill in my quarters. Yep, let's go take the quill. Okay. Uh, what else did I need? And there was another area of this hatch here. What's down here? Ooh. They're Can I open this chest? Chests. Okay. What's going on over here? Looks like water's getting in. Ugh. Okay. Um, two parts of monkey blood. Uh, red wine. And a wine hold. So this is probably where I'm down. I am down here. 
right front. So, what's in... There's probably something in some of these chests here. Uh, right. Look. There's some very fine wine in here. That could work. Why not? That's red. Um, okay. And we need a live chicken. <laughs> well, I've got a chicken. It's not live, but it might work. Brimstone. Sulfur, which is explosive. Um, oh, right. So, what's in these kegs? They look like kegs of gunpowder. Ah, that's a, that's uh that's sulfur. Uh, can I take these? Wow, gunpowder! All right. Take some. Uh. I've got enough gunpowder for now. All right, cool. And the last bit I need is one or more. Well, I need one or more of the following. Don't look very natural. They're artificial. Um. Oh, right. Okay, that makes perfect sense. So, cereal is filled with all sorts of artificial stuff. All of the remaining ingredients after the very specific ones are artificial. So, that's probably what's going to happen. All right, let's put this all together. I put in the cinnamon, the four mints, I put in the skull, uh, one squirt of squid ink. Use feather pen with cooking pot. <coughs> And let's see. Two parts of monkey blood, so let's put in the fine that wine. Should that should be enough. Okay. One live chicken. It's not live, but here's the chicken I have. A Whoop. rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. About time I got rid of this worthless artifact. Okay. Three ounces of brimstone. One. Oh. What? Oh. Okay. Oh, all right. I guess that's all I needed. And then uh, let's drop the cereal in here. Mm, this is going to be good. Okay. Uh, now what? That's everything, right? I can't move it. Whoops. Directions to Monkey Island. Oh, I got a pot to 400. All right. Did it walk to Red Hot Fire? Ouch. That's hot. Well, That's yeah. Hot. No kidding, Guy Rush. All right, so... Oh, maybe if I take... Maybe if I pick up this pot. Yep, here we go. That and then I use... I this... Move it. Come on. Use the pot with really the cooking happy. pot. Uh... I'm only going to put this on if I really have to. Okay. I must be doing something wrong, then. Directions to Monkey Island. Preheat pot to 450 degrees. <laughs> Add the Let bubble over low ingredient. flame until thickened. Uh, look at... It's full of crap. I hope I don't have to eat this. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, you're gonna. Um... Yeah, so that's everything in there. I do I have to just wait? Cuz it's on the fire already. So, hmm. Uh, <coughs> all right. I can't pick I'm, that up. Maybe. Do I need to talk to them? Oh. Hey, I found a map to Monkey Island. So. <laughs> okay. So that, that didn't do much. Okay, let's. Um. I'm gonna give you mutineers five seconds to come to your senses. 
Then I'm gonna start kicking some butt. Excuse me, Guybrush. Does the word keelhole mean anything to you? I see your point. Thanks. <laughs> It's just all right. In case you missed it, 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 that's another thing that happens in these games. The game gave me two options, but made the second one totally invalid. <laughs> That'll happen from from time to time. Um, so, uh, I I'm pretty sure I completed this mix. I put in one cinnamon stick, four leaves of mint, one human skull, one squirt of squid ink. Two pints of blood, one live chicken, one three ounce brimstone. Did I? Wait, did I not put in the cereal? Whoops, that's the wrong door. Because it's still in my inventory. The cinnamon's still there too, uh, which is weird. Hold on. Mm, this is going to be good. Mm. I loved this stuff when I was a kid. I like the way it chewed up the roof of your mouth. One or more of the following. Can I just... Mm, this is going to be good. I can't move it. <sighs> See, I don't understand. Do I have to just... Mm, this is going to be good. Mm, this is All right, good. I can just keep putting it in there, I guess, but... <clears throat> okay. Okay. I I don't I don't know what I'm missing here. I don't see anything special about it. I put in the cinnamon stick, the mint, human skull, the squid ink. So what's bothering me now? Let Guybrush know you've reached Monkey Island. Bring him up on deck. How can you get to Monkey Island? Um. All right, maybe, maybe I don't need to tell anyone. So, let's see here. I can't move it. Whoop. I'm only gonna put this on if I really have to. Okay. Attach the fuse to the cannon. So, can I? I don't see anything special about it. <clears throat> I need to so I've got the the pan, right? Yeah. It's about the same size as my head. Use I'm only gonna put this on if I really have to. Hmm. I've got the pot that I can use as a helmet. Oh, alright. Actually I'm wrong. Um oh, you know what? Alright. I don't see anything special about it. This episode's going a little long. We're almost done for now. I just want to see if I can get past this part. Go down the hatch. Let's grab some more gunpowder. They look like kegs of gunpowder. <sighs> yes, that's because they are. That doesn't seem to work. Uh, right. Open kegs. I'll take some more. I've got enough gunpowder for now. All right. Okay. Let's use the gunpowder with the cannon. Hey, there's no place back here to put the gunpowder. Uh. Oh, tip of. Duh. I knew that. With the tip of the cannon. Okay. And then. I need to get a fuse, it looks like. Uh, it's made out of a rope. I'm gonna have to find a rope in the hold. Oop, that's the wrong door. Come on. Go down the hatch. Look for some rope. Here's some rope. Let's take the rope. <clears throat> Okay. K. 
Okay, let's use this rope with the cannon. Okay, and can I... I'm only going to put this on if I really have to. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. I have to bring fire to the fuse. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to have to light this, and then I think I'm going to have to get in it. So let's do that. I will set this business card on fire. I'll just burn them all. Okay. Now I have... Oh, jeez. Now I have fire, I guess. Yep. Flaming mass. Use flaming mass on the cannon. I wouldn't want to set that on fire. Uh, oh, right. I need to use the flaming mass on the fuse. There we go. Get in the cannon. I have no desire to blast myself out of the city. Why? <laughs> That's what I need to do. Oh, I feel lost here. Can I... I can't just talk to these guys, right? Is there anything I can do to get you guys to help me? Uh, excuse me, Guybrush. You're blocking the sun. <laughs> I don't think they're going to be any help. Okay. What was that? It's nothing. All right, so... <sighs> I feel like I'm doing something wrong with this mix. I don't know what, though. I've put everything in it. <clears throat> All right, well, why don't we stop here, and uh, when we come back, we'll have this figured out. Thank you so much for joining me. Make sure you check out the rest of the videos on the GSL YouTube channel. Check out officialytr.com slash forums, and check me out at twitch.tv slash chaos control channel, and I will see you for another episode of Monkey Island next week. Take care. Bye-bye.